They can't get away from it. It's with them 24 hours a day. I've had kids crying in class. And people can say some really mean things online. I think everybody goes through bullying. For some, social media provides an escape from the norm, allowing them to do away with manners that would generally be shown in public. It allows people to be bolder uh, and to be a little bit more careless than the face-to-face -face interaction. You're sitting behind a computer, so it's a whole lot easier to type those words than actually go say it. Lone Star High School implemented Jostin's Pause Before You Post program. From yearbooks to classrooms and more, Jostin's is a company dedicated to positive student expression. Well, Mr. Bowser, our assistant principal, came to us and asked us to do something for the newscast. And he happened to come across this anti-bullying video. We played that video first, and then we interviewed different students who had been bullied and talked to them about the importance of not bullying around the school. They took the pause signs and we put on you know, each other's shirts. And for people who didn't know about it, they saw. I think it's a good thing because people who bullied before used to not really see what the effects were until it started getting put out there and more people started getting hurt. So Pause Before You Post is good because it stops people from actually used to bully back in the past. At the end we had uh, different organizations uh, get together and say they were on the plus side of the line. Students' past experiences with bullying have stuck with them. When I was younger I was bullied and it's not until you kind of grow up or you talk to someone about it, that's how it gets better. I haven't really been affected too bad. I've been called names, but there's not, it's nothing that's hurt me too bad. When I was in sixth grade, I used to have a breathing problem. Like, my adenoids was overly large, so I used to breathe, like, really deeply. And so there's, little boy, there's this little boy in sixth grade that would make fun of me every day for it. He like, walk past me, like, breathe really deeply and start laughing. So it really hurt my feelings, but after I got my surgery, it, like, went better, and he was, little, he was less mean about it. Online bullies beware at Lone Star High School because the school is adding their own touch. We're actually launching a, a new program that's going to allow students to report instances of bullying via text messaging. It's through our, our Lone Star High School Google account. Uh, we have a Google Voice account and kids will be able to send text messages to that number and then it shows up in my inbox as an email and we can at that point and then investigate the, uh, the, the instances of bullying. Lone Star is living up to Jostin's dedication to positive student expression. It's very important just to maintain positivity. Teachers, parents, anybody involved in kids' lives, either whether they're doing the bullying or getting the other side of the bullying, just maintain positivity. So we want kids to think and to stop and to pause and take a second to think about what it is they're posting before they put it out there because it lives forever. I'm Maddie Eggers for Frisco ISD TV.